Hi and welcome, this is Jam Jar 34 for another Warhammer Sunday mobile thingy on a Wednesday. <laughs> there, you can see. Right, just travelling through back back home to uh, the better half's uh, place. I'm in Kingston at the moment and the traffic is proper bad and having a cigarette so don't judge me on that it's been one of those days yeah. unfortunately I do smoke um, that might send my subs down by about all of them um, but there you go so what can I say um, bit of a lovely day yeah bit alright um, yeah I'm just chin chinning through the, there's so much road works at the moment up London ridiculously amount everywhere I go there's road works I'm trying to find quicker ways to get home and then you get people like that who decide not to indicate to the last minute and then not gonna do it. I was gonna hook my horn but I wasn't gonna do it on camera. Anyway, uh so what am I up to um from yesterday? Didn't get a video done, I was busy doing sanding of my um, kick, one of my kitchen walls um, so yeah no painting done apart from yeah getting my flat sorted um, so I thought I'd do another video I've got about 41 41 and 30 seconds uh, video I mean I hope you like these ones please down below if you uh, like them like this when I've got a chance um, and then I'm going to upload it later probably take about four hours didn't take the last one I did last night didn't take very long to um, download which was good um, hopefully not um, but I do you might just see the steering wheel a lot I'll try my big old day I am shattered I didn't 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 sleep very well last night so um yeah well i mean this could be one of the one of the paint along videos you can hear me ramble on the way to way to work and um sort out all the idiots on the road and put the well to rights um right on this video and i've got like i don't know i just seem to have loads of stuff to say at the moment I don't really know why I'm very very my appetite's gone out which is good lost a, I've lost a lot of weight um, through a bit of stress but that's I'm not going to go into that that's personal and private just letting a learner go through I remember when I was a learner, but I was a better learner than that one was. Um, but they've all got to learn, as they say. Uh, yeah, I shouldn't be too bad. I was like that once. Yeah, it's been very windy lately. I think everyone's been eating baked beans at the, at the present and a couple of uh, Vindaloo curries and whatever curries, Thai green curry, Thai red curry, uh, Thai curry. Why isn't there a blue curry? That's what I'm thinking about. What's blue though? Broccoli can be a blue curry. Um, yeah, so I'm, I'm just getting into the back end of sermon, I think. Love. It's like traffic. We like the traffic going on. 
I haven't really spoke to you much about hobby yet at the moment, but I'm concentrating and Whoa man, it's cold while having a cigar. I'm just gonna pull out on someone. Right, so what I gotta do? Keep the stress level down. Um, I hope no one is offended. I do smoke. I have said that. Um, I should have done it before. Had one before I did the video. But there we go. You see my you see, you see my ugly face, son. Yeah, I'm quite. It's quite hot actually. It's it's reading. It's about five past four. It's about 23, 23, 23, 23 degrees in the old mobile hobby kitchen. So what have I, what have I got to talk about? Um, These things, if you can see them. My new bracelet, not bracelet, but stones of tiger's eye, red jasper, silver, and uh, uh, so septio or something. Malachite, that's the one, and silver. Bought by the better half. Why is she the better half? Because well, I can't say she's the worst half. Um, yeah, so, right, let's go back to hobby. I'm not talking much about hobby. Um, got a message from last night's video from Idic Beer, and I can't remember the question. Oh, it's about hoverboards. Uh, I'm not going to answer that one. I'm going to answer that one when I get and do some painting, Mr. Mr. Beer Man. But thank you for your comments. They're not kind words. They're honest words, my friend. Um, most of my most of my friends um, I've actually met um, on YouTube, especially via Warboss Tay's painting challenge. And I'm just going to go straight on. Normally I'll do a left here, but I'm going to go straight on because I just can't be bothered and I want to talk. Um, yeah, I've found a lot of friends, but the thing is, though, I haven't actually met them. Um, but I feel like I've known you all for like ages. Um, Yeah, so, and I've been, because I've been so busy, I haven't done any challenges, and I'll start, and I'll start in a challenge, just letting someone out, um, the New Year challenge, I think I started that, and it just didn't go nowhere, because I was just too busy. Surbiton Health Centre, well that's nice, I'm in Surbiton. I might give you an idea of whereabouts I work. Um, oh, that's nice. Thanks for me for letting him out. And then you get someone who just walks across the road when there's a crossing like 100 yards up the road. But there you go. That's life. Some people just don't have the brains. <coughs> yeah, so what was I saying? Um, yeah, um, I've met loads of people on YouTube. I think I was saying that last night. Um, and I'm thankful for meeting them, to be honest. Very thankful. So, I appreciate you guys a lot, who I know.
love your videos. Um, and stuff. So. Mm. It's all good in my book. So let's go back to the hobby. Um, Big Mac dance girl. Yeah, mate. Big shout out to you. Oh. Hang on, I'm having a I'm having a blast from the past. No, it's gone. Something to do with world. Some, some, somebody's YouTube channel is something to do with something world. And let's cut this. I'm trying to. Oh, there's something in the road. Oh, I'm going to hit that. Um, I can't think of it. I'll have to have a look up in I've got I think I've still screwed subscribe. I've got to have a look and see what he's got on his see if he's done any more videos. It's something world. And he used to do the painting challenge and he's he actually reminds me a little bit of David Icke. If you don't know who David Icke is, some of you might believe his stuff. Um, since I've um, been with um, my fiance, um, she has shown me his stuff um, with the um, willingness not to pressure me, um, but to under, you know to let me think for myself. And I absolutely like what he says. I think it's some of it is a little bit like whoa. I can't believe that, but then he does. He's done research for over thirty years or so, um, and yeah, he's uh, he's a nice. He seems like a nice bloke. He knows what he's talking about um, in his world. People don't agree with him. But he says that um, yeah, he says horrible stuff about him, but he doesn't. He's what I like about him, and I know I'm going off topic, I'm going to be talking about hobby, but this is, um, I like the fact that he doesn't pressure people into, you know, it's not written in, in stone to agree with everything he says, he just wants to put it out there, he's done the research, so if someone's done the research, then... There's got to be some. There's, there's got to be some truth about it, to be honest. And this guy on YouTube, something world. Begin. I think it's beginning with R, but I can't think of his name. I don't think it's Rodney. No, it's not Rodney. And it will come to me when I finish the video and I'm having dinner or something, and I'll be like, oh, there you go. But. Well, it is technically. He, he does videos how sort of David Icke is. That's what that's that's what reminded me. Um, but there's loads of people that I haven't mentioned, so I'm going to shout out to everyone that I know on YouTube again, because this is poor, and I need to get back into doing certain videos. Right, let's talk copy now. Right, um, whew. 
gates of Antares, I have got shed load of gates of Antares. I went over overkill with it. Um, I've got to do. I've got to start doing them. Um, I haven't even played the game. I'm just putting models and models and models and models together and um, painting them. Um, as I said before, I'm so busy at the moment. It's ridiculous. Work's busy. My pers personal life's busy. Um, spending time um, with the fiance. Um, football is getting going to get busier. My life's just busy, and I need I need the hobby back. You know what I mean? I get my get the hobby back in me. Doing you know I. Should, I might even just do like a, right, it's a bit windy, I'm going to chat this, watch me get sweaty now. I've got to speed up now, got a bit of a lorry coming at me. Um, I've got to get the hobby back. In me, I've got to get it in my blood again. Um, I mean, I could do the cast, you know, if people haven't seen my you know, past videos and stuff, the banner man, that was amazing. That took me a whole week. That's with working and stuff, and that took me a whole week. And the detail I got on that, you know, is immense. And even that surprised me. I mean, I showed I showed a few pictures to a mate of mine, um, one of my mates down the pub, and he put me onto a Facebook group called um, Fluff. Fluff hammer, or something to do with that fluff hammer or something. Um, and he was like, "Oh, you should put your work on here, and you know, you've got a talent and everything." I said, "But I haven't got a talent. I just enjoy doing it." He said, "Yeah, but you're good." And I was like, "No, there's a lot of painters over. You know, there's a lot of painters better than me. A lot." Of them. Um, and I'm not, you know, I'm not the best. Um, I'm surprised I've only glasses, to be honest, to paint what I paint, you know, small things. Um, but, you know, he said, yeah, but you're good. And I was like, well, I'm not as good as everyone else. I want to be as good as, you know, um, Golden Demon type good. You know, that'd be nice, that'd be a nice achievement. But, I've got up to a quality that I'm happy with. I'm a bit of a perfectionist at the times with it, um, to be honest. Um, but, there you go. That's hobby related, that's good. Getting the, hob getting the hobby back. Um, yeah, Gates of Antares, um, thanks to Mini Warzone um, getting me into that. The models are quite basic looking, but they, the game is awesome. Um, he done Mini Warzone, Pete, Lord Pete of Mini Warzone done a lovely YouTube video series on it. Um, Great one, and yeah, it was great. That's what got me into it. Thank you very much, Lord. Um, but yeah, uh, what else have I got to do? Paint my beastman. That's an ongoing project from like years ago. Um, Going on now, the old police car. Noisy, noisy. Yeah, so I've got my CLs to do. I've got um, my Doran to do. I bought a big hundred pound box set, and I just haven't got around to it. I've got my Blood Bowl to do. I've got the Edition 8, I think it is, or 40k to do. 
um, the box set, um, the ultramarine box set, something of KF or something to do with that. Um, got that to do, so I've got loads of stuff to do. It's just finding the time to do it. Maybe when I finish painting my flat, I can do that and have a bit more time of doing that. It'd be nice. It'd be very nice just to sit there for four hours in the day and just not do nothing but paint and drink tea and do, do a couple of videos. I might even do a live one next Tuesday. Um, that'd be super cool. Um, had a nice message as well from Wise. I've forgotten. That channel, um, but that was a nice message. So thank you very much for that. So yeah, I mean, I bought some bought some paints um, when I bought. Um, I think I bought the shit record, got some money for my birthday, or some vouchers or something. So I bought that, and that was cool. And that was good. Um, I've got loads of scenery to do, I've got loads of base work, um, bases, so base work to do. Um, I've just got loads of loads of painting that I want to do, I want to get the hobby back. Hobby back in my blood. YouTube videos coming out on a regular basis would be nice, but I'm not 100% sure. It is a little bit annoying. Um, and now I'm starting to sweat. Just a little bit. <laughs> but there you go. Uh, so what else? What is else? What, what that? Oh, and I got a Lancaster bomber for Christmas. The story behind that is my dad. Before he passed away, he he basically passed away um, a month. Roughly a, just over a, a, a year and a month after I was born. So I was born in 1980, and he unfortunately passed away um, 1981 in May. And he was a navigator um, at the towards the end of World War. Well, no, actually, it might be World War II um, of a Lancaster bomber navigator. Um, so, my brother, who is who is in the navy, um, he's been supporting my hobby for me. Not as in buying all my things. I, you know, I buy some stuff myself, but you know as presents um, he bought me quite a lot of stuff so he's decided to buy me for, I think it was last Christmas just gone not just gone but you know um, bought me a Lancaster bomber and I was chuffed but because I haven't had any time to do anything I couldn't even make a video on it um, loads of stuff of it needs painting, it needs undercoating, um, and it needs loads of other stuff. And I just, like I've said before, I just don't have, I don't have the time. Let me drink some juice. now 23 minutes past four and as you can probably tell I oh, stuck in traffic yet again right I'm getting pretty sick and fed up of getting being stuck in traffic so It just seems to be traffic after traffic this week. 
Monday was horrible, Tuesday was horrible. Now, I'm going to try something, so I'll get back to um, the other half that I was flat. I'm going to try something to see if it works a bit better for me. It might do, it might not. You never know. Um, So the road works up here where I am at the moment. I'm in the end on the 20th, it's the 19th now, so hopefully they'll be gone tomorrow. Don't look like they've gone now, I'm in traffic at the moment this early. Um, so let's go back to the hobby. Um, I don't spray um, my base coat on, I paint it. Um, one of the reasons why I do that is because I can see every nook and nook blemish and um, if there is any bits that I need to green stuff I can look. Um, it's just because it takes longer but I can understand the model and what he's doing and this is my special little way of doing it. So, I do that, with a brush, and I just, I, I quite like it, it's quite therapeutic. Um, I find it quite nice, mm, I'm just thinking, um, I find it quite nice to do, um, and then I'll do double layers of the base coat suggested thin layers so I get me old water palette out sort it out put the paint in wash it around a little bit let it go dissolve into one and then it's done and then I wash on highlight it edge highlight it transfer it if it needs transferring this is alright it's all good um, Yeah. So what do you do? If you actually listen to the, this video the whole way through, please, please, can you do me a favour? Can you put down in the comments below if you read it or listened to it while painting? If you want to paint while doing it. I'm just rambling, as, as you well know. Um, if you paint all the way, you know, if you listen to it all the way through, put it down in the comments, please. That would be very handy. Um, I mean, this is going to be about 40 minutes long, so that being enough time to do a bit of painting. So if you're doing painting, let me know. Let me know what you're doing. Let me know what you're doing when you're listening. Um, obviously, Things there's things I don't want to know about, but why are you listening to me when you're doing them anyway? Don't matter. Sitting on the toilet, yeah, you know, I can get away with it, or you can get away with it if you want. Um, but yeah, just put anything, any comments down below, likes, um, questions you want to ask me about anything. <coughs> and Idik Beer's question that he put down, I will answer that when I'm doing some painting. Um, I'm quite sort of chilled out, sweating at the moment. Very, very, really, 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 really tired. Oh, speedy up. Um, I might get back by five. <laughs> I doubt it very much. It's been a lovely day. It's been a bit rainy in the morning, a bit showery, and then it's just come out and it's like 23 still. And I'm just like, whoa, that's too hot. It's working. Oh, that's why I'm sweating now, because I haven't got the window open. Right, so what else? Right. I'm not sure whether 
the books you get, so the Age of Stigma books, as in with the war scrolls in and a bit of back information. I don't think they're battle tools, I think they're just sort of like codexes to Age of Stigma. I could be wrong, and I probably am wrong, but I might be right. Who knows? So if you know, put it down in the comments below. Um, but they're definitely not battle tomb. Battle tombs are a bit more thicker. Um, probably about that thicker than those like that. Um, but yeah, so what I'm, I'm, I might plan, I might do a video of my work. What I've done, the completed, the completed stuff, um, and what I would like you to do when I do do that video is to put your comments about the stuff and be totally brutally honest with me, please. Um, don't just try and be nice to me. You can say, you know, you can have your say. Um, I might be a bit upset and start crying, but you know, I'm 38, so I should be able to take it. Um, I want you to be brutally honest with what they're like. Um, so that would be good if you could. What to call it though? Um, showcase of completed work might be a good thing. Yeah, so if you could, if you could do that for me, if I do do a video of my completed work, then, like I said before, be beautifully, brutally honest with me, um, because then I can, I can grow from that, um, and your comments, um, and if you generally do like it, then you generally do like it, but, you know, I'm not scared of a um, bit of con constructive criticism, that's always good, sorry, I think my hair's getting even thinner now, I'm getting even older, I've got to sort my hair out, <laughs> see, this is what I do when I'm in the van, I do a video, and I'm, I don't really talk about the hobby, I talk about other stuff like my hair, <laughs> um, Right, so let's have a look. 